What's going on guys and welcome to God of War Ghost of Sparta. I am officially two games away from finishing this entire series on my channel. I need to do this one in God of War 4. We're going to go ahead and do this one first because, I mean, I pretty much played through every single one before God of War 4. Um, all the console releases I have finished and these are the PSP games I need to complete. I just finished Chains of Olympus. Thank you guys for all the support on that series. I had a lot of fun making it. And now, I'm going to go ahead and move on to Ghost of Sparta because I have never played I have never even touched this game. I touched Chains of Olympus, uh, Chains of Olympus I think, at one point, um, but only played, like, the first level or so, so not much. Um, and Ghost of Sparta, I never touched. This game apparently had an awesome story, so I'm very excited to play it. And uh, it was actually, I think it won an award for the best handheld game of that year. And it got compared to, like, PS3 games at the time. It was very a, a very good game, to say the least. So I'm excited to play it. Um, I know about the story. I'm not going to say anything now, but later, of course, we will get into it. Um, but I am excited to play it. Just know that. And the story should be dope. So let's go ahead and get this started. Going to play on normal, as always. Kratos, the ghost of Sparta, had taken his place amongst the Olympians as the god of war. The bloodshed, the relentless battles, had finally brought him here. Ares was dead. And though Olympus beckoned, visions of his mortal existence still haunted him. Kratos, help me. Kratos knew that this was not a mere vision. For with the gods, nothing was ever as it seemed. The vision of his past set Kratos in search of answers. Answers that lay in the temple of Poseidon, deep within the city of Atlantis. This is not a wise course of action, Kratos. It was a dream, nothing more. The visions still haunt me, Athena. The visions you promised to take away. But this vision, I can change. Perhaps it is a vision best left unchanged. There is more to this than you know. Please. So I guess the game kind of said it, but this game is based between God of War 1 and 2, right at the end of 1. Because in God of War 2, we picked up on the throne, but he had been the God of War for a while. Yeah, this game looks pretty damn good, man. I mean, Chains of Olympus looked pretty good, too. I think this game came out a couple years later. But, uh, yeah, this game looks pretty good. I like it. I'm going to try to use uh, more combos, like, or get better at combos. Um, because I think in God of War Chains of Olympus, I did a lot better. And I mean a lot better than I did in any other God of War game that I played on this channel. So, hopefully, I don't suck at it again like I did in God of War 1. I think God of War 1 I sucked. <clears throat> Is this a Kraken or some bullshit? And I am playing this game like directly after I finished uh, Chains of Olympus. So I am definitely like, I'm ready to go. Like I've been doing this combat for the past, I think four days. It took me, took three, four days. It took me to complete Chains of Olympus. Taking my time a little bit. And uh, this game is a little bit longer than Chains of Olympus. Not much though. So should take like the same amount of time. But anyway, my point is, is that I'm at peace with this combat. I know what to do. I got the combos, all that type of shit. So, I know my shit on this game, hopefully by this point. Holding L1, press circle to force an enemy to the ground. I did that on accident, thinking it would do a combo. Can I just beat the shit out of him? <laughs> That's fucking awesome. Do I have any sort of combo? No, I don't have any combos like with the actual blades. So we got these ones at the end of God of War 1. These are Athena's blades. But... They're not fully upgraded like they were in God of War 2. Because we get them taken away from us. 
in God of War 2. Are they max level? No, they're level 1. Okay. So these are just the Athena Blades. Oh, okay, I get it, I get it. Let me say that again. We get these at the end of God of War 1, they're brand new. So now we're, level, we're leveling them up from level 1 in this game, and that's how they become max in God of War 2. Okay. That makes more sense. Can I break these? Nope. So God of War 1 and this one started on a boat. <clears throat> this kind of looks like uh, the scene from Ascension a little bit. Like the ending fight. There's just tentacles, you have to smack them like, just like this. The right stick to evade uh, while holding... Oh, that's, yeah, that's blocking, okay. Come on now. I can't tell when that other tentacle is going to hit me. Shit. Oh, he can't even reach me anymore. I guess I got to take those out too, but I want to take out the bigger ones and now that one got me. Son of a bitch. Wait, is this... Hold up. Oh, the heavy attack in this game is different. It's like a... It's like a swipe more than the... Um, I don't really know how to explain the other one. You guys know what I mean. If you play the other God of War games, of course you know what I mean. It's definitely different. Come on, dude. This thing don't go down. Shit. Maybe we weren't even supposed to fight. That was like a barrier or some shit. I don't know. Uh, yeah, I know I know this shtick. I got it. I probably should have turned off tutorials. Shit. Are we about to have like a full on fight with this? Oh god, yep. You look kind of familiar. The Skilla. Ew. Dude, it's attacking me with his fucking nipples. What the hell, man? I don't like that. Oh shit. How do I dodge this bullshit? Shit, I thought I was supposed to... I thought he was going to start smacking me again. Yep, there it is. You can't get me over here, bitch. Yes, you can. Oh. Oh, shit. Oh my god, this fucking thing's disgusting, man. It attacks me with its nipples, which is just gross on its fucking own, obviously, for its own goddamn reasons. And then it just starts spurting out these little guys. Like, you're growing inside of this thing? It's disgusting. It's only disgusting, really, when you think about it. If you're just playing the game, then you don't really think it's as gross. But I like to think about this shit because it makes for... <laughs> Interesting things to talk about. Grab it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I definitely... Okay. Turn hints off. Is that it? Is that hints? Usually they have tutorials and hints options. Ooh. Damn, we caught him in the fucking jaw like Steve-O. Damn. Ooh. 
All right, you took out one of its seven eyeballs. Oh. Did some fucking damage. I know that much. Where do we go now? Did he run? Intense will work. I like that. I don't know why, but the blue... The blue-looking blades are the... They kind of look teal in this game. More than blue. I mean, I don't really mind. I got no problem with them, but it's just weird. Like, them usually being orange, and then the Athena blades are blue. But I get it. You gotta make the distinction. Especially when these are, like, fucking gold and shit. How do you, uh, bash... Okay, it's R1. It seems like in the PSP games, it's a lot easier to find chests. Um, I noticed in the in Chains of Olympus. I mean, it's a lot of fun because you're able to upgrade your stuff pretty easily, but it, it makes the game not insanely difficult, I guess. I mean, I probably could play this on hard and not have any issues. I'm just going to create one save data so it uh, it saves on my, um, on my settings. Because I turned the music down and I turned the hints off, so I want to keep that stuff off. And plus, just in case this thing crashes. Which it has not yet, I will still say. PlayStation Now been solid. Ironically, the thing it has been crashing and kind of causing me stress is my Elgato, which sucks because it should not. And it really never has. It's just like, oh, you, you started doing these videos again? Like, you started making videos again? Now we're going to shit on you. Like, I don't know. It's just the way life works, man. What the f- More of these guys, man. Yeah, this slam is badass. I used this a lot in last game. I think towards the middle episodes of Chains of Olympus, I didn't use this that much because I was learning a lot of other combos. Whoa. I gotta use that. So it's square, square. Okay. Cool. So we learned another combo that I just realized I had. Can we go anywhere else? Oh, we can't. Nice. Is this where we're supposed to go? Does it look like we could go up here? Oh no, that was where they jumped out of. Never mind. There's nothing there. Okay. What is this? Ooh. This is a Minotaur, man. They weren't in Chains of Olympus, I don't think. They, or there was like a weird version of them. They didn't look like this, though. They had kind of stubby horns and were fat. Oh god. Oh crap, I tried to do the uh Oh shit. God damn, this guy's pissed. I mean we kinda chopped off or or not chopped off, but sliced his eyeball out and then uh pr pretty much broke his jaw. So I understand why he's pissed. Oh crap. I need to take this guy out so I can focus on the Minotaur. There we go. God damn it. Shit, man. That's really all I can do is the Prometheus Slam. That's what's going to take him out the quickest. I can't get to him. Come on. There we go. Oh, uh, they gave you a little animation in this game for that. That's cool. Usually it was just like a really quick headbutt. This one, he like really put some fucking force into that one. Oh, this is a time thing, isn't it? I bet it is. Actually, it might not be. Nothing over there. Usually they throw a chest right there. I think I hear that stupid fucking monster gurgling outside. Oh, these are a couple of our guys, aren't they? 
Probably doesn't matter. We'll get health from him if we kill him, I'm sure. Don't try to fucking... Yeah, we got health from him. Nope. Poor guys. They didn't even leave their bodies here, man. They just disintegrated with it. Dude, it's funny how, like, in God of War, they just make your teammates complete. Like, they're, they're nothing. I wonder if we're going to run into this big, ugly Kraken up here. I mean, we fought him not too long ago in this level. I mean, I guess it's been a bit. I don't know. He'll pop back up here soon. Ooh. Did they say they're searching for him, the ghost of Sparta? Oh, shit. Don't throw that shit at me. I will dodge like a beast. <laughs> Don't fuck with me. Okay. They got me once, finally. There we go. How many uh, orbs do we need to upgrade the, the blades? 2,900. Okay. Anything over here? Nope. All right, hold up. Before I move that, let me just see where the fuck are we moving it? Oh, there's some chest over here. Is there a second Gorgon eye? So, wait, so we, the only place we can move it is right here. Oh, I get it, okay. We can actually push it down there and then use it to get up the other side. I got it. I thought we had to actually clear that jump or we would die, but it's not like a cliff or nothing. Can I kick it? Oh no, we just get faster when we push it in the straight line. Oh, okay. Oh no, we can't push that down there? What? Ooh. When you combo it up a little bit more. Oh, okay, so where you would usually get this final strike on the just square combo, if you hit triangle, you will, uh... I don't know how I never noticed that. Can I push this over or no? Is there something down here, maybe? Oh, my fucking god. <laughs> I didn't look back down the path. I'm so dumb. My bad. That was just me, like, not... Not fucking looking, really. Is there a chest down here? I feel like I see a chest. Aha! I'm gonna grab it. I don't know why I say aha every time I find something, man. I do that in every video. Alright, can we just jump back up? Or can we jump to the, uh... Oh no, we gotta... Really? Okay. There we go. Do I need help? I don't even know if I do, but I'm gonna grab it just in case. No, I didn't. Fuck you, dude. Damn it, I missed. Get both of them? Nice. These guys are fun to beat up on, man. Can I go down this faster? There we go. Chains of Olympus, it was X. In this game, it's L1. How many orbs do we have, Matt? We might be able to upgrade after this. I don't know. No. We need 29? Yeah. Alright, so maybe orbs are kind of at a premium compared to Chains of Olympus. In Olympus, it was like they were everywhere, man. I was able to upgrade every episode, it seemed like. At least something. The Temple of Thanatos, the God of Death. A vestige of a long-forgotten time. Erected before the rule of the Olympians, this temple was not placed here by mortal hands. Within its walls, they are passage to the domain of death. Well, that sounds fun. Um, they said Thanatos? I guess he's the, he's the what? I can't remember what they said he was. 
Oh, the temple, god of death. Okay, there we go. Temple of Thanatos, god of death. Within its walls lies the entrance to a world that no mortal dares enter. I'm gonna take a wild guess and say we're gonna enter that door. <laughs> I know. It's probably a long shot, but... A man can dream. Is there any chest over here? Nope. Another door we gotta kick open, I'm sure. Yep. And the elevator. Fantastic. Yo, it looked like they showed Kratos' butt. I'm not even lying right there. Like, that looked kind of kind of gross. You guys are just fucking weak as shit, man. My god. It's very fun to kick the shit out of you. Uh-oh. Somebody died over here. Which way are we going? This way. What the fuck? Oh, these are the guys. Okay, that's right. I forgot we got introduced to these guys already. Damn it. I'm trying to fuck. Oh my god. That's what I was trying to do before. Come on. Oh, the dive's just like the one in Chains of Olympus. Which is awesome, because for some reason I love the dive in Chains of Olympus way more than any other game of God of War. I don't know why. It just looks cooler. Oh, great. Like, I haven't seen a million of these guys. It's alright, though. They're fun to fight. Oh, God damn. That was a vicious hit, bro. Shit. It's like fucking Big Show. What? I wasn't even in the radius of that punch. I could probably keep getting these hits in. Oh, these are... Okay, they, they didn't have these guys in... Uh, they had the, the the model of their uh, of their character type, but they did not have the like two. I don't know how to say it, like the two health system for these guys. Like here, we smack his face on the ground, and he keeps going, but we get a second button prompt, and this time he's dead. Whoa, he's not dead yet. Holy shit. Okay, maybe these are like way more powerful than I thought they were. I thought this was just a normal troll, man, but he takes some fucking hits. And you can't really use combos with these guys most of the time, or most of the time anyway, so the only thing we're gonna... The only way this is gonna get easier is when we get the damage upgrade. When we upgrade the blades, so... We'll probably be fighting these guys the same way throughout the entire game. There's always a new way to execute them, though, every time. You either stomp the blade into his eyeball, or you do that... Or you rip his eyeball out. And there's this ugly motherfucker again. What are we doing? He's just staring at us, man. We've established you guys are weak pieces of shit. There's something down here. Hell yeah, there is. So that troll was just waiting patiently right here, right in this circle. Because there's no way he could have come up from anywhere. He was just trapped there forever. And he was just waiting for the time somebody came by to scare the shit out of him. Can we not go? Can we not get these? Oh no, they're facing the other way. Poseidon, I'm assuming. Oh, I was just to read that. Is that? Hold up! Wait, wait, wait. That is the place we're supposed to go. Okay, I thought I saw a doorway over there. I did, but there was nothing in it. 
So I'm going to go this way because this is the way the chests were. And I'm assuming... That they're right here? Where are they at? What the... That's where I thought the chests were. I guess not. And more of you guys. If that's the right way to go, there's probably something over here. Nope. Just fucking taunt me. Hate it when they do that. Bro, I'm getting tired of your shit. Jesus. For some reason, it feels like some of them are stronger than others. I know that doesn't make any sense, and it's not true, but still. Something over See, these are perfect spots for chests, and they just don't want to don't give me nothing. Damn it. Whoa, 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 whoa! Really? You didn't even give me enough time to get over the bridge. I was walking straight the entire fucking time, and then I just got cock-blocked right at the fucking end. Well, whatever. I guess we'll just call this thing the fucking Bridge of Death, because that's what it is. At least they spawned me right here. So let's roll. There. See, it does fall quick, though. I guess I just thought that it would break behind me, like, cinematically. I don't know. Whatever. Do I need this health? It doesn't, like, prompt your health and shit when you're opening the chest. Is what I just noticed, and it's starting to annoy me a little bit. Uh, a little bit. As Poseidon took dominion over the seas, he erected... Uh, erected. A monument fit to his glory, so was born the great city of Atlantis. With Lord Poseidon as their guardian, the Atlanteans thrive beyond all other societies. Alright, I don't... didn't want to read all of this. These devout and peaceful citizens stand as a testament... Uh, t whatever. Testament to mankind's future. Alright, whatever. I thought that was only... Th I thought those were usually just like one panel. Most of the time, anyway. I guess not. In the distance stood the Temple of Poseidon. A monument erected by the Atlanteans. Uh, to erected. the greatness of their protector, the God of the Seas. Yeah, we kill him brutally. Is there anything back in these parts? Nope. What about on this side? Nope. Know thyself? I am Kratos, bitch. You shall know me too. Because I will snap your neck and gouge your eyes out. Throw you into the sea. Spoiler alert. It's not a spoiler at this point. But still. Oh, is this like a flashback? I know there's flashbacks in this game to him as a kid. Kratos, bring Demos inside. Demos, that's his brother. How oh, I have missed you, Kratos. What treachery is this? Another trick of the gods? No, my son. It is me. Your father brought me here. I have waited so long. My father? <coughs> we do not have much time, Kratos. Your brother does not have much time. Trapped in torment, deep in death's domain. But he's gone. You told me that he was- I'm sorry. I had no choice but to lie. You must listen now. The temple 
of Ares in Sparta holds the secret that will lead to your brother. The road will not be easy, but you must help him. You must, Kratos. <coughs> he needs you. This cannot be. Why? Why would you do this? Your father forbid me to tell my you. My father? Who is my father? The fuck I wasn't oh my god my hand wasn't even on the controller dude that's a lot to take in I wanted to talk about that shit but I guess we're gonna fight his mom oh god what the hell she's so disgusting ooh okay oh there was a QTE and I was just spamming square so I guess spoiler alert if you don't know uh well I mean I guess spoiler alert I mean, Zeus is fucking, is Kratos' dad, of course. Um, but in, in God of War 2, it seemed like he was very surprised when Athena told him that Zeus was, uh, was his father. So maybe it was like, he didn't really believe his mother or something. And then once he got, once Athena told him, it was like, okay, yeah, this is true. So now my mom has told me, and Athena has told me. I don't know if, I mean, I'm sure that's what they're going for, because this game was made after God of War 2. I think it came out in 2000. I don't know, man. 2009, 10. I don't know. I mean, I'm, I know it was after God of War 2 for sure, because God of War 2 came out in uh, 2007. But anyway, this boss fight's kind of cool. It's again like the ones I usually like, and this thing is gross. I'm sure after this we'll have enough to upgrade our blades finally. Nope. Damn it. Dude, I'm trying to get away from that. Get away from me. Woo! Wait, what? I was out of the way of that. That's some bullshit. Shit. Get the fuck off of me. Oh, I only got in two hits on that one. I was trying to see if that was like automatic or if I even needed to press square and I did. Oh, it looks like she's dead. Or almost dead. last breath, she released the weight of her burden, and finally found the peace she had long sought. But for Kratos, the rage was almost palpable. Fate had once again pushed him to the brink of madness. That actually, that was pretty emotional, man. Callisto's armlet, keepsake of Deimos and Kratos' mother, beat the game to use this item. Yeah, probably will not beat it and play it again, so I doubt I will ever use that, but that's some heavy shit, bro. I mean, Kratos has lost a lot, and he's a crazy motherfucker, but I mean, 
He is a damaged soul, I tell you that much.